Ever felt like this? You have an exam tomorrow, your mind is full of questions, and you're stuck with a bunch of books and notes, not knowing where to find the answers to those questions. No more endless searching, no more stress. If you want to rest your head on the pillow and sleep peacefully on nights like this, don't miss a single second of this video. With Tenorshare Chat PDF, just upload your document and within seconds it'll answer any question you throw at it. First of all, go to the Tenorshare website and I've placed the link in the description for you. Once you're on the site, from the Tools section at the top of the page, go to Chat PDF. After entering Chat PDF, click Sign Up at the top of the page. You can log in either through your Google account or with your email and password. Once you're logged in, click on this section to upload your PDF. Then, select your file. For example, I want to upload a document about viruses. It takes a few seconds for the text of the PDF to be analyzed. After analyzing the text, you can ask any question you have from the panel on the right. For example, I want to ask, what kind of virus is the coronavirus? As you can see, the answers are very complete and fully match the text in my PDF. On the left side, it shows the PDFs you've uploaded. You might need to refer to multiple references for a single question. From this section, you can upload several PDFs, and the answer this tool gives you will be based on those files. In this section, you can see the full analyzed text of your PDF. Let's challenge it a bit. For example, I want to upload another PDF about bacteria. Now, I want to ask it a combined question. What's the difference between viruses and bacteria? As you can see, the answer is very thorough and perfectly aligns with the references I provided. Now, let's ask, which is more dangerous, viruses or bacteria? As you can see, it responded very accurately to my question. You can use this tool for creating questions, reviewing your problems before an exam, or even for daily tasks like cooking tutorials. If your usage is at a normal and standard level, the tool is free. But if you need more specialized features, you can purchase an account from the website. The account prices seem reasonable, and discounts are periodically applied. And if you buy an annual account, the price gets even lower. In comparing the Pro account and the Free account, I should mention that the Pro account allows you to ask up to 500 questions per day. While with the free account, you can ask no more than 30 questions a day. Also, you can upload up to 500 files per month with the Pro account, while this number drops to 3 files in the free account. The Pro account allows for PDFs with up to 2,000 pages, while the free account is limited to 30 pages. Both accounts are heavily supported by the company, so there's no need to worry about customer service. Additionally, the Pro account offers a 30-day money-back guarantee. I really wish I had known about this tool during my student days, because I think it can be extremely useful, especially for those who want to clear their doubts and weaknesses before an exam. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked the video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the channel. Until the next video, bye-bye.